hey everyone welcome back to my channel today i have a project share uh i just received a, a three-way swap like you make three and you receive three and it was called poblado navideño it was a christmas swap and i just wanted to send a little thank you to the three girls who sent to me uh and so i made just a little kind of valentine's -y small mail to send out and i will show you what it was that i made so first i did like a heart pocket actually i wanted to do these ones bigger but it turned out my biggest heart die is this size so i couldn't make it very uh much larger uh, i think i'm gonna have to order a die that is a little bit bigger but i still think it looks pretty pretty cute i used for the decoration this is uh kind of a mix a lot of uh collections but i mostly use the new one from celes gonzalez i think that's her name and poppy and pear from bivalent uh and i really really love this ducky is the cutest thing this one is from uh bivalent's new poppy and pear collection the puffies and they're like just the cutest thing ever i love the puffies they're small but big enough that you can actually use them and it has a lot of uh, tiny animals and you know i really like tiny cute animals and this is really really cute plus the flowers from the flower pack from salas gonzalez i think that's salas gonzalez let <laughs> me just check so i'm not saying it wrong yeah it is i oh, know salas gonzalo it's not gonzalez i'm sorry it's gonzalo gonzalo this is the ephemeral pack, but she has a flower pack, and the flowers on that pack are just the most beautiful flowers ever. So, like I said, this is a little pocket, and inside, I was going to put everything inside, but it kind of strains the pocket, and I'm afraid that it will uh, ruin the cluster. So I'm just going to put one thing inside, and then I'll make a little packaging for the other things. So I'm putting this heart here that I made. This heart has some lavender inside, so it kind of smells nice. You can put it in your wardrobe or you can just do whatever you'd like with it, but I think it looks pretty cute. So I'm just gonna tuck that in there like that and that's it. And I probably put my note in here as well. And I think it looks pretty cute. Then I did uh, this envelopes. This is a dye, this actually, the die uh it's open you know you can put things here i have some i think i have some oh i have some here Duh. i'm sending her one she can decorate so as you can see it is open like this and actually it doesn't have a back it is open all the way but i put a back so it kind of is a little pocket so i made one I used some uh, uh, Spricks die cuts, I used this butterfly that it was sent to me a while ago and it's just really cute and then I die cut it, some stickers and I think it looks pretty cute and I'm sending one to her so that she can decorate. And then I made this tiny little box, I have also a die that is a nesting die, it, the smaller one I think is probably this one and then the bigger one I think it might be like this and i think it's really really cute and it has some dimension like this and i think it looks cute and then i did some uh it's i think like this shaker embellishments this is i used two dyes to make this one i used the this kind of flowery dye and i use um, a circle dye i just got the flowery first and then i put the uh, circle dye in the middle and i uh, put it through my big shot again and then I made this I'm sorry if it's shaking my table shakes a lot I don't know why and then I made this little pick I thought it looked cute I put some a little bit of uh, gold thread I'm not sure if you can see it very well because I'm filming in a little bit of a different position so I cannot really see the camera that well but I hope it's showing okay and then I just put some little cute thread and I think it looks good. I was going to stitch it, but it's too tiny. It, it just looks really messy. So I just, you know, glued it and I think it looks cute. So this is one of the sets. And then we have another one here. This is a pocket. Again, a lot of puppy and pear and 
Rainbow Avenue, I think that's the name of the seller's Gonzalo collection. And some of these studio tickets. I do love to use tickets. And it's a bucket. And then for this one, we have this heart here. You just stick that inside. And then this envelope, they're pretty similar, just a little bit uh, different with it with the colors, but pretty much the same decoration. This one here that she can decorate. I really like these colors from this one. These are really pretty. And then the little book. These bunnies are so cute. This one was sent to me a really long time ago. I still have a lot of those. Those are really cute. I really like them. And then this shaker here. As you can see, I did the uh, threading around a lot of the, a lot of times because I could just I couldn't make it like perfectly the one time so I just made it a lot so it looks like the mess is on purpose which it kind of is and it kind of isn't but I think it looks cute and then this is the pick for this one and that's one and then the last one is this one and for this one uh, this is the little pot and I love the kitty the kitty is just the cutest thing ever come on I wish I had a lot of those and then it's the bucket and for this one we have another one with this paper I really like this paper it looks like kind of uh, oh this one has an, a different paper on the back I didn't remind didn't remember that uh, it kind of reminds me of wallpaper, those old wallpapers. I think it's really cute. And this for this one, I use some C binding. I think that's how you call it. And then, oh, I need to switch this one because they're they're pretty much the same. Let's just do it like this. This is one. I put that one there, so they're kind of different. And then this one. And this one is the book. This is the flower, kind of flower dye. I used a lot of poppy and pear puffy stickers for all of this. They're just so beautiful. I need to get another pack. And then this is the little pick I made. And yeah, it's just a little thank you mail for the girl who sent me those, those beautiful, beautiful houses. And I hope you enjoyed this video. If you have any questions about any of the things that I made, let me know. And I hope you're having a great time. Bye.